Ahoy there, I'm Tiny Pirate, and welcome back to Happy Room. Now, in the last episode, you all said you wanted miniguns, so here they come. They look like they don't have much range, so I'm going to make sure we can bounce the guy over there. So we're going to keep... I suspect we're going to need at least a couple of bounces to keep him over. So let's see what happens. Are we ready? Here we go! Fall! Test subject one. Ah, uh, <laughs> yes, I was right. <laughs> Just keep shooting him, miniguns. How much ammo have they got? Oh, they're all running a bit low. Almost. Yeah, 1,000 minigun damage. A few more shots in there for good luck. No, the minigun doesn't actually make a great deal of noise. I'm kind of surprised. <laughs> and then it explodes. <sighs> okay, so great. We cleared that one. Brilliant. Um... What's the next challenge? So, shoot seven shotgun shells. Let's do that now. Um, oh, okay, well, I think we can do it the same basic way, right? We'll just knock this guy over here and uh, bounce him. Keep him over that way. One, two, three. Let's have a look. And... <laughs> oh, poor guy. Okay, we're going to need a lot more. Um, bouncing. If I put this here and that there, then um, I put another one over here. I'm just going to try and keep him away from being... Alright, he's being blown. Oh, no. Alright, let's try putting the portal down here. So hopefully if he does get blasted over that way, he'll fall in the portal. Yes? No, he's being bounced. <laughs> just playing jiggling juggling with him juggle juggle bonk did we do it uh i think we must have we must have done it i didn't notice it that's brilliant now what else is next so um all zones clear uh dummy touches maces five times let's have a look at the maces where are they what do they look like Oh, like this. Oh, that should be easy enough. Look, I can just put five maces sort of here-ish. I'll just scatter all these maces around. Let's see what they do. How many maces can we fit in this room? Okay, let's have a look. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh, that doesn't really work. Um, what if we put a shotgun... No, we need something a bit more ranged to push him around a bit, don't we, I think? Yeah, if we had a bit of range, then he'd bounce around um, amongst the shotguns. So the crossbows have the best range we've got so far. Not shotguns, what am I saying? Maces. Yeah, keep pushing him. Five maces. Yes, we've done the five maces. Do 2,000 damage. We're actually getting pretty close to that too. No, nearly. Oh, not quite. Just a a jump a couple of jumpers like that so he bounces around in the maces one over here in case he falls out let's see what that does oh he's just he's just okay <laughs> he's just being pushed around <laughs> oh, fully used three maces oh yes we've done that one brilliant 2000 damage bounce <laughs> oh no yes 2000 damage yay okay great now <laughs> You can stop shooting him now. How much can we juggle this guy? I, it's 15 seconds. That That's quite a long time. Try, we'll try it like this. I'm not sure it'll count. Like it might. 15 seconds. That's a lot of shooting for him. Oh, yeah, they're pushing him back. Good on you. <laughs> Just juggling him in the middle there. Keep him up. Keep him up. Keep him up. Keep the ammo going. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh no, we, <laughs> we lost it. <laughs> oh, but we did quite a lot of damage. Oh, the juggling's happening again. The juggling is clearly the way to go, but we just need enough. Oh, okay, we need enough weapons to make this work. So let me clear these things here. That should, I mean, that should work, right? That should bounce them around just fine. Here it comes. Juggle, juggle, juggle. And what we want is all of them to get a bit of a turn so they don't run out of ammo early. I can see the ammo bars going down on this one, which means he'll retreat, and then the others will take over, I guess. 15 seconds done. 
That's amazing. That is. He's still hovering. He's still going. Oh, look at him. Poor guy. Just being juggled by the machine guns. Right. So, we can clear that again. And oh, what are we going to do? We've got more melee weapons. So, axes. Oh, wow. That looks pretty, pretty terrifying. Um, what does that do? I want to watch this first. What does it do? Oh. Just... Oh, okay. If we're going for this 1500x damage, I suspect we're going to need some bounces to keep him uh, moving. So we're going to try for bounces like this. Come here, you. And uh, let's see if that will do the trick. Okay, come on. Oh, yeah, we need lots of deck x damage to make this work. Back you go, into the mix. Yes. Yes, come on. We're getting very close to 1500x damage. Almost. Yes, 1500x damage. That's awesome. All right. Oh. <laughs> He's still bouncing around. More damage for you. And there's going to be a boom. And I think that's pretty much it. So what are we going to try now? We could do hit monster with an axe 20 times. Well, we have lots of opportunities for monsters up here. And we can do seven monster bites with the dummy as well. So let's see if hit a monster with the next 20 times. That's going to go quick. Awesome. That one's achieved seven monster bites on the dummy yet. Are we going to see him bit or are we going to see all the monsters just chopped into pieces maybe? Uh, it looks like we might hit those monster bites eventually once we finish juggling with monsters. Oh, yes, that was a whole bunch. Come on, monsters, get stuck in there. Bite him, bite him. Nom, 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 nom. Nibble him. Yes, do it. One, nope. Seven monsters bite dummy. Oh, we're short on monsters. Oh, that's the actual problem here, is we need more monsters. And we've done it. Took a little while. Seven monsters got there in the end. So let's move on to the next challenge. All right, we're going to try the axe spikes and saw, because as far as I can tell, they all need to hit in some kind of sequence. So if we sit here with the axes and the spikes and the saw going, axe, I saw it flick there for a second. I don't know if we need to juggle him. Here he comes again. Axe spike saw, that's completed. Brilliant axe spike saw. Love it. Broke the saw axe thing, but hey, that's okay. So brilliant. Dummy staying frozen for 15 seconds. I, I, I don't know what that would be. Uh, fire gun damage. No, we don't have fire gun damage. Deal 4,000 damage. Now that is something I think we can aim to achieve. So really just a string of explosives will do most of that for us. Followed by... Um, what am I going to put in here? Followed by maybe some... Uh, axes or some shotguns or something so let's give that a go and see what that looks like and we'll turn them that way and the top spikes let's see what this one does <laughs> four thousand <laughs> we didn't even i uh, didn't even need the source i kind of want to see that one again but i really i really want to trap him I think that would be good. Now he goes up very high. So I don't know. That could be. Would that be enough? We could get rid of these and put a bouncer on the bottom. So he'd come up, bounce. Uh, let's have a look. Cut head with axe. Now I don't think we're going to achieve any of those, but we might be able to just keep him in the vicinity here. And we do have a block we can put in mm, can't put it anywhere else okay let's just see what that done does oh, oh god okay so he explodes up the top after he's bounced well i think we can solve that one very easily and we can go like this keep him in and then he'll just bounce and get chopped and let's see what that does Boom! <laughs> he gets spikes as well. <laughs> oh, I feel sorry for him. Look at this damage we're doing. Almost added new weapon acid. Well done, us. 
He's caught perpetually in our exploding. Oh, that's brilliant. That's cool. I like that. So we've got whole new toys to play with now. What do we have here? We've got an ice gun and an acid gun. So frozen for 15 seconds. And that doesn't seem that hard, to be honest. That seems pretty... Oh, okay. Well, we're going to need... Hmm. I think if we bounce him, we can just freeze him all the way up and down here. And that should be plenty. All right, let's try this. Oh, no. Oh, you... Okay. So, the way to keep him from going anywhere is... Ah. Oh, you know what? Let's get clever. Let's get much more clever than that. Okay, so we'll line that up with the center. And... Is this, is this going to work? I'm worried that they're all going to run out of fuel and I won't get my 15 seconds. But if I space them out, they won't all be in range the entire time. Let's see. <laughs> 15 seconds. <laughs> He's a little icicle. <laughs> Look at them. <laughs> oh, that's just terrible. <laughs> oh, yep, he's just falling endlessly. I feel sorry for the little guy. Okay, so how are we going to tear off a frozen part? Hmm, if he came up... Oh, this is where it's going to be very tricky. I don't know how we're going to do this, except maybe to put him through a grinder at the same time. So I'm going to try for tear off a frozen dummy part. I want to see what this one does. Oh, he bounced out. Oh, he bounced through those. Hmm. So let's put another bouncer in. One here um yep and one here and one other way around here and here okay let's try can we chop anything off it's not he's not really being chopped apart i don't know how to crack him oh tear off a frozen dummy part his head came off <laughs> his head oh this poor guy's head got blasted clean off and now he's stuck there lovely <laughs> all right so time for one more challenge. I think we can do one more challenge today. And I'm thinking all dummy parts in acid. Acid. Let, let I want to see what it does. Okay, so if we put a teleporter here and one here and a block. I'm going to put a block there and a bouncer. And, oh, I can't put the bouncers on the ceiling. Well, if he comes up and comes back... Oh, I know, spikes. That will keep him in place if he does get bounced back through the portal. Then he'll come back through. Now it's time for the acid weapons. Um, something like that. I don't know. I mean, how much acid can one dummy take? He goes in, falls through, bounce, acided, acided, comes back, <laughs> falls in. <laughs> oh, bounces up, uh, falls back in, uh, and back in the hole, and pop. All right. Well, we did complete that challenge. I'm feeling pretty pleased with myself. Next job is tear off dummy's limb, which is in acid. I think we know how to do that, and we're going to try in the next episode. I hope you'll stick with me. If you like this video, then do try clicking on one of the pictures all on your screen right now. There should be some cool videos for you to watch. And if you really like what I do, then head to Patreon. You can see the link there and give us some support. Handing out game keys soon to Patreon, so that'd be a pretty good opportunity to get in right now. Until next time, I've been Tiny Pirate. Good night, have fun, see you later.